Right, I just saw a comment on one of my videos saying, drop a video on how to set boundaries for people, see? Right. <laughs> this is one thing I want to let you know, bro. You've got to understand, the thing about boundaries is, you got to actually invest into people to set them boundaries, bro, you know what I mean? Like, let me just give you an example, bro. Like, if I was just back in this matrix and I had no YouTube channel or nothing, the way how I set boundaries with people is with by verbally communicating with them, but... I'm telling you, bro, verbally communicating with people just goes throughout one ear and out the other, bro. Like, this is why I had to leave the Matrix, bro. This is why I had to jump on YouTube and just leave people, bro, because they don't listen, bro. They don't, people don't care about your fucking boundaries, bro. I'm telling you, people walk all over you like you're nothing because they feel like they're something. Literally, and they feel like they're something. And the thing about everything is they will, they will do the worst things to you you know what I mean? Um, put you in the worst situations, put involve you in drama, make you get in trouble because of them, and they will have no consideration for it, bro. They wouldn't care, bro, because they feel like they can get away with it. See? This is why I'm telling you, bro, you, you can't set boundaries with these people out here. This is why I tell you to jump on... I'm giving you the best advice, bro. I'm telling you, jump on YouTube and make a YouTube channel and that's how you set your boundaries bro don't be setting your boundaries with people individually because that takes too much energy and most time people don't even fuck with you like that to even be thinking about boundaries with you and shit unless if you're like some celebrity that's the only time people are really going to respect your boundaries man other than that people don't give two fucks about you bro about, two, your, about you your boundaries how you feel your feelings or nothing bro as I said bro unless if you're like some super a, a, um, um, a class celebrity or some big um, idol ball. Boundaries are out the window. This is why I tell you to um, set boundaries online, bro. You have to, you have to set them online, bro. Because I've tested that on reality. Try to set boundaries with my family. Try to set boundaries with uh, friends and shit. Man, people overstep it. Uh, do you dirty and shit without no care in the world because they feel like they can get away with it but see if they can feel like they can get away with it you gotta put them in that mindset of right you're gonna lose me if you don't that that's one way you can really do it to be honest you're gonna like you can just be like to the person if you don't stop what you're doing like i'm just gonna walk away from you and i'm i'm not gonna come back you know what i mean you can be like that verbally or you can be the type of guy where you're just like Let me just, like, you could be that type of guy where it's be like, oh, let me just set these. Like, I don't want you to be doing this anymore because I don't like it, but. Man. It won't work, bro. It might just work temporarily, like a couple days, weeks, but people won't remember how them. People won't remember them boundaries with you, bro. As I said, if you're like a younger person, especially if you're a younger person, bro. Man, these adults would love to just talk shit to you. Um, uh, you know what I mean? Talk shit to you, just all this extra stuff because they feel like they're older than you and they have more power over you. This is what I realised. People, people that are older than you and stuff like this feel like they have more power over you. Man, no one has power. No one has more power over you, literally. Make sure you have power over yourself and don't be giving your power out to people. Because that's, how, that's one way how you get people to overstep your boundaries and just cross you, bro. Is when you give your power out to them, being nice to them, um, doing favours for them for nothing. You know what I mean? Letting them use you, giving them free shit and stuff. This is how you get people to try. This is how you get people trying you, being genuine. But this is why I tell a lot of you guys out there, if you don't want people crossing you like that, bro, don't be genuine with people out here and fucking friendly and nice and, and nice and shit because people think twice about crossing you when they feel like you'll just get rid of them but you know what I mean this is why I'm in that mindset now of just like literally fuck you bro you wanna, you wanna try to do something to me or speak speak some foul shit over my life or some bullshit but I'll just get rid of your fucking ass bro literally I'm telling you you gotta start reciprocating people's energy for them to respect you bro that's what I realised 
it's either you throw out the crud energy onto them or they're gonna keep doing it to you until you just explode but I'm telling you but that's the answer to your question but I'm telling you boundaries man if you're a kid trying to set boundaries impossible <laughs> My best, as I said, but my best advice to you is make a YouTube channel and set your boundaries through there. See, see how I set my boundaries through on YouTube channel. See how I set my boundaries on here. I think people overstepped me so, like crossed me so dirty out here, disrespected me so bad. But you see what I did? I resurrected myself by setting my boundaries up on here. And now these people, it's like they, they're forced to look at it, but see, they're forced. Dead. I didn't even ask them, I didn't ask them, tell them about my boundaries, bro, they're forced to see my boundaries, you know what I mean? That's what you gotta do, bro, you gotta, you gotta make people, you gotta, this, you gotta force people to see your boundaries, and that's exactly what I did, bro, that's the best way to do it, bro, because that will, it will instantly hit their minds, bro, and it will, the thing is, my, it will always be there, you know what I mean, it will always be there, and yeah, bro, And the thing is, who do you want to set these boundaries with? That's one thing you got to ask yourself. Are you setting it with your parents, your siblings, your 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 friends, just random strangers out here? I'm telling you. But man, I'm telling you, this this get to the point where you're just like. Not even boundaries, bro. Just get to the point where if you take disrespect from people, just walk away from them. I'm telling you, bro. As soon as you receive disrespect from someone, walk away from them. And trust me, people will see that you have boundaries then when you walk away from them. You will see, trust me. But man, um, I don't even know, bro. Literally. Because out here is just man people are just running their free mind you know what i mean they don't be caring about other people's personal space and their their feelings or nothing but i'm telling you people you gotta understand but people are all about themselves so once you get in a mindset once you get in a mindset of people being about all of themselves You won't be caring about setting no fucking boundaries, bro. You'll just be, you'll be in that mindset of, right, I need to be caring about myself, bro. I'm telling you, when you get in the mindset of caring about yourself and not other people out here, bro, then boundaries will already be automatically set because it's like, you'll be in a mindset of, right, if, the, if anyone ever crosses me out here, I'm just gonna just remove them, bro. I'm just, literally, I'm telling you, bro, that's your boundaries right there, bro. Having self-respect to yourself, literally. Have self-respect to yourself and the boundaries will already be set, literally. And the thing is, you can't be giving people two free chances. Literally, give people one chance, but that's what I realised. But man, I hope, literally, I hope that just, I don't know, but I, I hope that this helped you out a little bit. I feel like I did explain it as best as possible, you know what I mean? But man, I try to help out all my supporters as much as possible, man, because if I was in your situation, I wanted help and I, and I asked you for help, I wish that you gave me some help as well. So this is why I, I gave out as much um, help to people on my channel as possible because man, I came up all on my own and I've been through so much shit on my own as well. And I don't, if, if people come over here and they want to try get help off me, man, I'll give it to you because... I love to help out people that give me... Like, people that give me give me help, like, you're giving me help by watching my videos, liking my shit and commenting. Literally, if you give me help, bro, I'll help you out, bro, you know what I mean? See how this dropped a fucking 10 minute video for you, you know what I mean? Literally, you got you just got a personal video right here, bro. Imagine that. Literally, you really got me on this camera. 
dropping a video for your ass, man. God damn. Literally, this is how you know I'm, I'm really, bro. This, I'm more loyal to some of my, my supporters online than I'm more loyal to people out of my reality, bro. Imagine that. I'm telling you, bro, living on the metaverse is like the best way. I'm, I feel like it's the best way to live out here because if you're on a high vibration and you're a chosen being, bro, or you're just someone that don't like to take a lot of shit from people out here, you can't live in this matrix, bro. I'm telling you, you can't. It's impossible. The amount of light, the amount of deception that's out here, it will eat you up, bro. I'm telling you. But man, I hope that helped you out, bro. Um, stay tuned. Looks like I'm missing the building.